We got them kind of double capped right now. A nice little three piece. Can we get the four? Can we get the four? Can we get the five? Oh my God, bro. Can we get the six? The six. <laughs> the seven. Oh man. The Striker 9 SMG just received a huge update to it in Modern Warfare 3, making it one of the best SMG options to use for Modern Warfare 3. Just to show you guys here, you can absolutely just zap people now with this updated Striker 9. This thing got an update across the board with like damage ranges, different recoil control adjustments. This thing, it honestly feels really good now. In today's gameplay, we end up dropping over 110 kills with an MGB nuke with the newly updated Striker 9 SMG in Modern Warfare 3. And I've of course got you guys the best class setup for the striker nine so if you guys do enjoy today's video enjoy the class setup make sure to leave a like and subscribe without further ado let's go ahead and get into it so going over the first attachment this is the zem n35 compensator flash hider now i've been using this a lot more in modern warfare 3 and even in warzone as well this is a muzzle that a lot of warzone guns really need on them and this gun actually fits really well with multiplayer giving it vertical recoil horizontal recoil and firing aiming stability now the two things that is going to hurt is your ads time and bullet velocity now you really won't notice that with an smg however if you do want to switch this out for a suppressor i definitely recommend going with the shadow strike suppressor just to basically keep you off the radar now to help just further increase the bullet velocity and range we end up going with the striker recon long barrel for bullet velocity range and aiming idle sway and then for the underbarrel, just to give us better recoil control and also ads time and sprint and fire speed we end up going with the sl skeletal vertical grip now if you want basically just straight up movement with this gun and just feel a little bit more light on your feet on smaller to medium range maps you can definitely go with the dr6 hand stop however you will lose a little bit of that recoil control i did also try out the ftac msp 98 hand stop this is also a great option as well if you want better movement speed now personally i think the 50 round mac is a must with this gun because this thing has a decent fire rate and you're going to burn through ammo without even knowing it you could definitely go with the 40 round mag if you want just better movement speed but the 50 round mag if you want just full-on ammo definitely go with this and for the last and final attachment just to give us better recoil control gun kick control i went with the stock and zx grip and now it's only going to hurt your aiming idle sway which you really won't even notice it with this smg now there is all five attachments if you guys are looking for the best record nine class setup for modern warfare for three multiple if you guys do enjoy the rest of the video and the gameplay make sure to leave a like and subscribe and i'll catch y'all later take care everybody are right, you guys using the newly buffed striker 9 in modern warfare 3 and this thing is actually so crazy i'm actually going to change one setting real quick here on my controller i'm probably going to die here in a second please don't see me please don't see me i'm trying to change this one tap to reload okay i've been playing a lot of uh warzone ranked if you couldn't tell uh, but yeah, we are using the Striker 9 here in Modern Warfare 3. Like I said, dude, this thing got a crazy buff to it. Or well, I would say it got adjusted. I wouldn't say it really got buffed. Um, some of the damage ranges, I think, got buffed, and some of it got nerfed. But overall, it got adjusted, and it feels actually just so much better. I mean, it actually felt pretty good before. But now it just, like, for some reason, it just feels ultimately better. It basically has, like, better vertical recoil control. And like the recoil is just easier to control overall. I think that's why most people didn't really like it. It's because the recoil was a little crazy sometimes with it. Oh my god, we're just freaking going crazy on these guys. Ooh, okay. Damage ranges aren't really that bad on it either, to be honest. No, man. Wait, I just get sniped by something? Oh, I think I did. No way, bro. All right, they're going to come up here. I saw two piece. Is there one more? Oh, maybe not. Where are these guys at i think they're yeah they're back here for sure dude i haven't played on this map in a long time i've just been playing stash house and just the other i've been playing the small map plays but haven't gone this map in a long time had to reload there for a second hopefully they're coming up here wait what i did not even see this guy here we go Shout out to my helo, getting that guy. There's a guy all the way back here. Buddy is just not moving from there. All right, we're picking it back up here slowly but surely. Getting that guy right there. I don't know, man. Just something about this gun. It feels so much better with, with the recoil that it has now. Just basically just straight vertical recoil. It's a lot easier to control, honestly. And we just died there again, too. I didn't even realize. Took my, took my brain half a second to register that. I got him. Oh, he was right there. Well, they're spawning back here anyways. Doesn't matter. Is there one more? All right, pop the UAV. Get that going. Oh, they're, oh I think they're all going to be coming right here. Hold on. Come on, buddy. I'll just push him, I guess. Oh my God, I got them both.
All right, I'm gonna push back a little bit. I mean, they're all back here. They're just literally sitting in this corner. Yeah, those, those guys are not moving from back there. I'm gonna move around this way. Get a different angle on him. No, I, I think they're spawning back here nowadays. Oh my God, yeah, they are, bro. What the heck? Okay, we got the advance. I'm gonna pop this now. It's a smaller map, so we will be able to see everybody in time. Is there one more right here? Oh no. No, bro. Wait, they're all three back there, man. Oh man, we are actually selling on this nuke right now. I can't even believe it. We are just selling on this nuke. All right, we still got the advanced though, which is good. I wanna play a little more aggressive here. Just kind of risk it. No, wait, wait, wait. Oh my God. I almost, I think I almost died of my own helo. That would have been crazy. Okay, here we go. Playing a little bit more aggressive. Kind of working out in my favor, to be honest. There we go. Oh my God, this thing is kind of nuts. I won't even lie. And it has decent visual recoil too, I'll be honest. It's pretty easy to control just visually, honestly. Okay, there we go. They're just all back here. Got him. Still going crazy. Let's pop this other helo. Get this going. Oh my god, we're just snapping on him. We're at a 21. We still got the advance up just a little bit longer. Oh my god, I nearly died there. These guys are like, these guys are like, GG, we're done. This guy's about to go crazy. Yeah, I think we're pretty close here. Oh, guy just ran by. Where, buddy? There were two off. I have a feeling that the other, I was gonna say, I have a feeling they're gonna be back here for some reason. Where are they at now? I might as well just capture B. Maybe make them come over here. Make them come over here. Do a little bit of OBJ for him. Okay, we're one off. There we go. There's the MGB with the newly buffed Striker 9. Like I said, this thing is crazy. If you haven't tried it out yet after the update, they made a couple of days ago to it. You guys got to give it a try. This thing is so nice to use now. And I also heard it's pretty good in uh war zone as well that guy's doing a little finishing move on him there we go i mean i guess we'll just keep the streak going we got them kind of double capped right now a nice little three piece can we get the four we can get the four can we get the five? Oh my god bro can we get the six the se <laughs> the seven oh man we just kind of went crazy there i won't even lie that's where I just, I was gonna say, that's where I just saw somebody there. You didn't see me, buddy? Oh. Uh. All right, now they're, are they back here now? Bro, I don't even know where these guys are. I think I kind of messed with their spawns a little bit with me kind of rushing that. Dude, and we're still on the streak, I just realized. Dude, I was like, wait, didn't I just die? But I haven't yet. Still on this freaking streak. Oh, okay, there we go. Got him, got him. Got you as well. Oh man, this gun is this gun's saucy. Oh my god, bro. Nearly died, but dude, absolutely just zapped that guy. This gun, even at those ranges too, is crazy, bro. No, we finally died, man. We were on like a crazy streak. That was like a 50 kill streak or something, dude. Oh no, bro. 
Bro, we literally though that was that was honestly a crazy streak. Hit this guy. And this game is basically over at this point. God, those three guys do cap cap and B. Zippity zapped. Oh, but that's my own teammate. I'm actually trolling. I am actually trolling. But my teammate's working on some like McDonald's Wi-Fi or something. Anyways, well, that's basically the game. We're going to call this in now. Might as well. Game is basically over. Call this in. We'll call in the Overwatch Hilo as well, just to stir the pot a little bit. Sauce on that guy just a little bit. Sauce on that guy as well. And there we go, man. There's the MGB with the newly updated Striker 9. Like I said, this thing is crazy. If you guys are more of like Warzone guys, it's a good gun for Warzone as well. If you, if you guys enjoyed today's video, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. I'll catch y'all later. Take care, everybody.